first month's rent for you. And hey, the entrance to your garage is on that side street over there. Thanks, Joe. I appreciate it. Hey, and about tonight, we're going to a real classy joint. So buy yourself a nice suit. They won't let you in this place look like an ex-con. My kind of place. <laughs> I really do like this apartment. It's nice, small, nothing too extreme. Okay, here we are. I'm sure you'll find it to your liking. As you can see, it even comes with a telephone at no extra charge. <laughs> and here's the bathroom, clean and modern, with all the hot water you could ever want. My bathroom is huge. The master's bed. It's comfy, with room enough for two, maybe three, and it doesn't squeak. Get the fuck out! In my book. I gotta open my windows. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. Just one question. When are you leaving? Now, if you'll pardon me, I have to go and check out another client. Goodbye now. Yeah. See. You. Have a beer. I'm all about the whole, you know, um, I'm all about leave, leaving things wide the hell open, if you can't tell. I think everything is open right now. Awesome. You know what? I think we need another beer. Just to celebrate. Alright, let's do it. I'm leaving my door wide open. Yeah, you definitely had another client. Let's just smoke inside. At least there's a fire a fire extinguisher right next to you. All right, whatever. <clears throat> ruff, 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 ruff. Uh, the garage is right around the corner. Why do I think I want to drive my car? I have just enough to fix my car. I'm doing it. Let's go. I don't know how my driving's gonna be, so hopefully not too bad. <laughs> oh yeah, let's gun it, son. Oh shit! I hit him. I'm sorry. I'm so I'm gone. I'm running. Up, up. Oh shit. Can't drive anymore. It's been a couple days, guys. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm coming back to Joe's house. I don't know why I went to my house to get on a pair, get on a suit, and then go back to Joe's house. Somebody just got kicked the fuck out of his house. Jeez, I thought you was gonna be a no-show. Not bad. Nice material. Nice. Yeah, thanks. So, uh, I wear it all the time. You'll find out. A friend of mine's coming to pick this up. I met him when you was on your little vacation. Hey, show him some respect. He's kind of an important guy. Oh, yeah? Oh, I bet. We'll see you in a minute. Here he comes. Hey, Joe. Hey, Eddie. Here I am. How's it going? Man, not too bad. Not too bad. Oh, this your buddy? Yeah. This is my pal, Vito. Vito. This here is a good friend of mine, Eddie Scott. Nice to meet you, Eddie. Same here, Vito. Okay, fellas, I'm dying for a drink. Let's go. Yeah, so am I. Hey, Vito, you want to drive? Ugh. I had a couple of drinks already. So, I did too, uh, but I guess I'll drive. Ride, Joey? Nope. All he knows is that it's a surprise. <laughs> uh, he's gonna love it. I fucking hope so. Turn the light Unless off. Unless he got into the uh, funny thing. Hey, what are you two talking about? <laughs> Don't worry about it. You'll see. 
Hey, come on. We might as well call him now. All right. Let's go, Vito. Hey, you know, it would help if you told me where we're going. Hey, Toys, the back. That ain't telling me shit, but okay. I don't believe in stop signs. Just to let everybody know before we do anything else. I don't believe hey, in stop Vito. signs. What was the one thing you missed the most when you was in the camp? Freedom. Yeah, Pizza. Well, but besides that, nah, you know, uh, booze, broads, baseball, everything. Now you're getting closer. <laughs> what are you guys taking me to a baseball game? No, we're taking you to the classiest cat house in the city, Vito. Cat house, huh? Wow. Well, you don't sound too excited, Vito. Come on, don't tell me you don't want to have some fun after all that time. Hey, don't worry, Vito. These girls are real professionals. Yeah, they're really professional. They get checked all the time, just in case. And I swear to God, they get one STD. They're no longer a part of the club. Oh, hey, uh, remind me not to drink too much. There's something I gotta take care of later. What's more important than pussy and boots? Now, you know how it is. Sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. Hey, Vito, come on, step on it, eh? Okay, you're paying for the ticket. Take your fucking foot off the accelerator. What hey, what guys, am I I'm in a rush. What am I doing? Am I going fast or am I going slow? Yeah, they're totally packed. I would love to live in this time of year because it was like back then like everybody dressed nice and like a, a girl smoking a cigarette was like rebelish you know and like nowadays I think I think it's about equal now women and men smoking anyway anyway enjoy the cutscene because Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Scram, baby. So, Vito, listen. I work for Carlo Falcone, and uh, we're looking to expand our operation. Joe's been working for us for a while now, and uh, since you're a friend of his, we'd like to extend that offer to you as well. What do you say? Yeah, sure. I'm interested. All right. Let's drink to it. Here's to you guys. And to a bright future together. Touch and I can't be drinking too much tonight. Uh, I got some business to take care of. Didn't she just end up? Didn't she just end up giving him a blowjob before all this happened? I'm not 100 percent sure, but that, I think that's what happened. I don't think he cares. You whores. Yeah. Hey, where the hell is my car? It's right uh, here, dipshit. Somebody stole it. Hey, hey, call the fucking cops. You're There's one right behind me. Let's go, you dumbasses. Uh, oh, oh, yeah, good. Get in the car. Hey, where's my keys? Vito's gonna drive. He's the least fucked up out of all of us. Yeah. 
Next time for us, Joe. More pussy, less poos. <laughs> Get in the car. At least one person knows how to listen. So, how'd you like the place, Vito? Lots better than playing I this uh, Zeech in the shower, huh? <laughs> what? <sighs> oh, the hell's that stink? Eddie, hey, you puke? What? I wouldn't puke in my own car. Why not? What the hell is that smell there? Then again, I don't know. I probably wouldn't puke in my truck, though. So. Must be Frankie Potts. Come on, that asshole puked in your car? Ah, oh, no, nah, he's in a truck. What? What? Hey, it's all your fault, Joey. I told you I had some fucking business to take care of, and you and got me drunk. Hey, since when does business to take care of mean dead guy in the trunk? Dead guy in the trunk, there. There's a dead well, guy in the hey, trunk, there. Ah, you fucker. I already got a spot picked out. Up by the old observatory. <sighs> got a shovel? Sure, it's in the trunk. And the hole is already dug. All we need to do is check in and cut the Uh, dog, right, where's this hole? Yeah, a little ways outside of town, there's a path in the forest to a small clearing. That's where the hole is. Yeah, I'm up, will ya? God, I need some fresh air. The stench back here is fucking killer. Open a window. Oh shit. Wow. Whew, they don't build them like they used to, huh? Damn. Eh, fuck it, it's your car, you can hurl in it all you want. Too late to <laughs> Puking it up, son. Christ, Eddie, that, that fucking reeks. It's his car, I don't give a shit. Exactly. Yeah, but that smell, plus the other smell. The only way it could get worse now than he craps himself. He probably will do that next. I mean, it wouldn't be right. I mean, we gotta have every scent here, you know? We got a dead guy in the trunk. He puked all over himself. Now all we need is somebody to piss and shit on themselves. We'll be just... We'll be... We'll just be great. And then we'll get a nice scented candle just for shits and kicks and see if that'll help any. You know what's weirding me out? They didn't do anything else with the observatory. You know, until, you know, later in the game. But they didn't do anything with, like, this outside spot. You know, like, these houses just hanging out out here. I don't know. Maybe Mafia 3, they'll have, like, a buying system. Like, where you can buy your own house and shit. That'd be cool. Just personal opinions, I guess. All right, we're here. Rito, go pop the truck. Is that a joke? <laughs> That's great. That's just great. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, let me take care of everything. God damn it, you shoes. Jesus Christ. <clears throat> Christ almighty! How long has that been in here, ready? Uh, just a couple days. You're gonna have to get him out of there, Vito. Ah, it's just great. I can't handle the smell. I'm a fucking welcome home business. Oh! Oh! Hey, mother. Hey, hey, he's a hole. Right here. Dump him in. I would be so pissed off if my friends did this to me.